You signed up as a student at Christian Leaders Institute. You're taking ministry training. You have a dream to use your training to be a revival leader. And then the doctor says, you have cancer. The cancer keeps growing. He doesn't give you long to live. But you're believing I may be healed by Christ. And even if I'm not, I'll be with Christ forever. So you do not stop ministry training. And you keep it going. And you will keep it going until your last breath. My daughter Abigail has chronicled the story of Christina Carr. I invite you to watch the story. It moved me. It changed her. And I believe it will change you as well. Christina Card. Christina is the mother of four, which pictured on the screen, she is with her two youngest sons, and she has shared with them her faith, you can see from this photo, and the other photo is her profile on CLI. Christina and me first started talking when she became a vision partner in the springtime. So I finally got online. I told her I'd like to speak with her on the phone, and it was an instant connection with her. I'm sure we've all, you know, you have those moments when you get touched by the Holy Spirit. And I got touched when I talked to her for the first time. Christina used to be a jewelry maker. She's now retired from that. The last thing I did was making jewelry, which after 15 years I had a store. And I was very successful with it and I got sick. When I first got on the phone with Christina, she, her voice sounded a little raspy. And so I said, oh, is this not a good time? Should I call back? I thought maybe she had a cold. She said, no, uh, my thyroid's been removed. So, you know, calling another time wouldn't make a difference. And I, I'm, I was shocked at that point. I'm like, oh, oh no. If you read my story, I'm battling cancers still and um, it's pretty much everywhere in my body but we all know that the flesh is not of God so I had some chemo and I had some radiation and the a lot of the cancers in my esophagus so I can't eat solid foods and I have to have nourishment through a feeding tube which gets put up my nose and down my throat. If any of you haven't experienced it, you don't want to have it done. Um, so there's days when I can't speak and there is no voice. A series of really hard things happened to Christina. Her parents both died, four other relatives in the span of about a year just died and then she finds out that her thyroid cancer is out of remission and has spread and and I I heard that and I I can't even explain that Christina's still positive attitude and and how she was it honestly changed me I stopped having treatment um, I prayed a lot about it and God said it was his turn to take care of me. Christina still loves to sing. She loves to still preach. And even though she has gotten a notice of having two weeks to live, but Christina's a fighter and she doesn't even believe that she only has two weeks. She is ready for whatever God has for her. And she's not afraid of the future because in Christ, Christina is more than a conqueror. Christina then messaged me on the network and said, hey, I'd love to give you a call. I, I have an idea for a vision partner video. And the idea Christina had 
blew me away. I mean, it was awesome. Every wall in my room is covered with the Word of God um, or with encouraging quotes and whatnot. It's even though I believe God's going to heal me, I still prepared my place, um, so to say, and it soothes me to be able to say, you know, James 4.8 is on the wall. Well, Christina said, I think it'd be awesome if CLI students did that, to kind of show who CLI is, because CLI is all of you. Each of you students are what makes CLI what it is. And so I was like, that's great. So she recommended maybe even singing a song or a verse. And so after talking with Christina, I was inspired to do Romans 8 as the verses that represented Christina and represented what CLI is about. Um, with her asking us all to read the scripture and um, I got touched when I talked to her for the first time and it was not to have this happen I am very humbled and very honored and when I found out about this it just I dropped to my knees in tears praying to God um, thanking him because my entire life I've been dedicated to the gospel, to the word of God. The book of Romans is so appropriate. Abigail could not have chosen um, a better book in the Bible. Christina, you have made me look at things differently. And so thank you for that. And thank you for the amazing idea. Thank you for the time that you have put into CLI into those that you love and are around and I I just can't even explain how much this Romans video what it means and the essence of who Christina is and what CLI is so when you guys see this final product I hope you see it in a way that also inspires you I hope you see what CLI is about but mostly I hope you see a little bit of who Christina is. And Christina, I really hope that you are honored by this video. We know that in all things, we know that in all things, God works for the good. God works for the good. What shall owns daughter own when he didn't say? For the good of those who love God. Who have been called. Who have been called according to his purpose. According to his purpose. ¿Qué pues diremos a esto? What then? What then shall we say? What then shall we say in response to all of these things? To these things? If God is for us. If God is for us, who can be against us? And who can be against us? Who can come against us? Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? From the love of Christ. From the love of Christ. Shall trouble or hardship or persecution or nothing or nakedness or danger or danger or sword. Knowing all these things, we are more than conquerors. More than conquerors through him. More than conquerors. We are more than conquerors. We are more than conquerors through him who loved us. Through him who loved us. For I am convinced that neither death, nor life, neither angels, nor demons, neither the present, nor the future, nor any powers, ni poderes sobrenaturales, ni lo de arriba, ni lo de abajo, neither height, nor depth, nor anything else in all creation, in all of creation, will be able to separate us. Will be able to separate us from. Will be able to separate us. Will be able to separate us from the love. Este amor que Dios nos tiene. From the love of God. From the love of God. From the love. From the love of God. Del amor de Dios. From the love of God. That is in Jesus Christ. That is in Christ Jesus our Lord. In Jesus Christ our Lord. It's in Christ Jesus our Lord. Vandaar in Jesus Christus. Onze Jere is nie. Christ Jesus. Our Lord. Christ Jesus our Lord.
Amen. 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 Losing a friend to save someone, as we say, to lead them to the Lord, to give always and forgive and to love is what the Bible and the gospel is all about.